Hi, I'm Vivia Gugnani and we're here at Anthos. We're taking a trip to the Aegean to taste some upscale modern Greek cuisine. So let's go behind the burner and meet the chef. I'm here with chef and owner Michael Salakis. What are you making for us? Uh, well, we're making a big kind of Greek salad. We play around with Greek food here at Anthos. We're going to take all of this, we're going to toss it together with a, a traditional vinaigrette, a red wine vinaigrette. We've done two things with the vinaigrette. We've added a little bit of uh, yogurt to this one. So it's a red wine vinaigrette that's been emulsified with some sheep and goat milk yogurt. It's a fantastic product coming out of Canada. Okay. So instead of taking that feta cheese and crumbling it all up into the vinaigrette like my mother would and have all the natural juices of the vegetables kind of meld with the vinaigrette and the feta cheese to give you that wonderful creaminess that we know that defines kind of Greek salad. We're pulling it apart a little bit, so we need to get a little bit of that creaminess in there, and that's gonna happen with this yogurt just on the bottom of the plate. Got it. We're gonna just start by just taking some vegetables. We have cauliflower, radishes, there's some baby leeks. These have all been poached off a little bit. So we have so all different poached, kinds of romesco. Poached, you mean what? Just blanch and shock. Okay, so blanch, you mean you put it in boiling water. Hot water, salted, you take it out, out put you it right put it in ice. ice right in ice water. Stop the cooking process. Stop the cooking, keeps the color of the vegetable really, really bright. It keeps the crispiness. Yes. Some wonderful, really thin slices of various radishes here. We use a mandolin, fantastic piece of equipment for the home. These are really great things that people throw out. It's just celery heart leaves. Of course. And these have so much flavor and they're really, really tender. Now these are not the leaves that you find on top of the stalk. You have to really open it up and they're really, really tender and we save all of them. These are really beautiful, beautiful things. They add so much flavor. And that's an ingredient that people really never use. They never use, it's a little, it's like a byproduct of something that you would use for a soup or a mirepoix of some sort. And all of a sudden you get these little tiny beautiful leaves that say so crisp. We keep them in water so they just really say nice and crisp. And they're just wonderful thrown into any type of salad or even garnishing fish. You can do so many different things with them. You know, just pick the things that you kind of like. And this is just a fun salad. It really is. It's almost like a crudite, kind of mixed up with a little bit of Greek flavor. And it's a lot of fun. We're going to take now, this is just that Greek yogurt that I was talking to you about. With the red wine. With the red wine vinegar. Red, 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 red yeah. wine vinegar. And we're going to do like what we call a swoosh, which is a really, really simple thing. We're going to get a big dollop of it. We're going to take our spoon and we're going to just take it from one end and don't stop in one quick motion and do one of those. Now we're really, be, we're really being fancy. <laughs> we are. Okay, and we have an even fancier platter that we serve. <laughs> I was just gonna tease you about that. We'll wipe our plate down just so that nobody sees. Perfectionist. So we did it. Uh, yeah. We came back out here, we made a, our, our famous Anthos Greek salad. We took all these wonderful vegetables we have a ton of root vegetables in here, wonderful carrots, turnips, there's white asparagus, there's uh, patty pan squash, there's artichokes, we have all different types of radishes, we have heirloom uh, tomatoes, and we have heirloom eggplants, and we have three different types of lettuces, and we have obvious the big ingredient here, feta cheese. You can't have a Greek salad without feta cheese. I don't think so. <laughs> and we just toss it all with a, a red wine vinaigrette that we've emulsified with a little bit of yogurt. And we dressed our greens with some lemon and extra virgin olive oil. And I think we're ready to eat. It's salad time. Yeah. I think what's fun about this salad is that you get, to, you get to pick what you want to eat and then you could fold in some of this feta cheese as well and you can see how... The feta cheese is just tangy and then you have the citrus kind of mm -hmm. pungentness of the lettuce and then here you just have this kind of mild... Really kind of fresh, vegetable, light vegetable flavor. Fresh, flavors, yeah. light vegetable flavors. Behind the Burner members can enjoy this exclusive opportunity to purchase Michael Salakis' favorite medley of garden fresh vegetables at Baldor. Stay tuned to Behind the Burner, where we give you the tips, tricks, and techniques that are lighting the culinary world on fire.